built up this enormous business all across Africa. You've taken these huge positions, and Mubarak is falling in Egypt and Cairo. The stock market is collapsing in January. Um, we're watching it on the news. How were you able to think your way through that? Did, you are listed on the Cairo Stock Exchange. How did you, you know, what was it, like a war room? Or what, how were you dealing with that scenario? How were you able to keep your head when everybody was losing theirs? Well, we didn't lose our head, but we obviously lost our shirt on the valuation of the shares. So that's, uh, <laughs> so that's, uh, that's for sure. No, I think, I think the key issue here is that we, um, <clears throat> we never were linked to specific, uh, I mean, we, we, were never, we were never too close to the political uh, ac active uh, ingredients of the Egyptian scene, okay? Uh, and I think that's very important. We always labeled ourselves and positioned ourselves as being an Egyptian company and not a pro this or pro that company. And I think this is very important.